Don't pretend in the comments like you've never broke apart on your motorcycle like this girl. This girl is the only person to ever do this. No, I know I'm not alone. This is what happens when I do things in the garage unsupervised. Hello, YouTube. <sighs> Can I huff anymore? <sighs> um, this is... This is not the video I intended to be making or giving you guys this Sunday. Um, <laughs> let's be honest and candid here. Hi, I'm Biker Bay Beth and I broke my motorcycle. Yeah, I broke it. How did I break it? Let's get into it. Um, the next video that you guys see next Sunday, we'll get into the uh, specifics of how I broke it. But just know, it's broken. And it's hella broken. No, I'm kidding, it's not that bad. Um, I bought the replacement part already. Shout out um, and sorry to the eBay seller that I've already bugged and said, hey, I broke my motorcycle, it's in pieces. Please send this soon, thank you so much. Sorry, eBay seller, but I need this part. So what happened was I got a nice new SNS air filter. And I, I don't like to follow instructions very well, so I skipped a step, just one simple step, and I managed to uh, crack my intake here. Not a big deal, but my throttle induction intake manifold right here has a crack all the way through. <gasps> I heard it crack. Didn't get it, it wasn't on video when we cracked it, but uh, we did, we cracked it all the way through. She's gone, she's done. This induction area, throttle induction, gotta throw it away, gotta get a new one. So hopefully that eBay seller sends that out soon. And you know, just for transparency's sake, the Sporty's gonna be changing. I'm putting some updates on her, new air filter, hopefully new pipes, hopefully new painting over the winter. Some things are happening to the Sporty. I want her to look different. I'm ready for some changes. Ch -ch changes Turn the face. Ch -ch change. I'll stop singing. Anyway, so the goal is change the sporty. And the first step was a nice new air filter from SNS, but in the process, a broker! She's broken! And so the video you get today is an update that I broke it. Good job. Wow. Um, talent? Skill. It takes talent and skill and a lot of m a muscle. Um, yeah. And so, broke some metal straight through. That's all right. Parts coming hopefully soon. eBay seller, please reach out back to me. And uh, yeah, once that part comes in, slap on and finish the beautiful SNS air filter video that I have for you guys. I'm really excited. It's gonna be a fun video and that'll be next Sunday. So please don't be mad at me. This is all you get. Happy holidays. Merry Festivus, whatever you may celebrate. I know that this is the uh, weekend of Turkey Day for a lot of you folks. So happy Thanksgiving to you and your families. And thanks for hanging out with my channel through all the ups and downs and me just, you know, being a clown, breaking my motorcycle. I'm proud of myself. You know what? It's my biggest f up yet. And it was all because I was trying to put on a new air filter. Really roast me in the comments. I would love it. Honestly, in the comments, I want to hear how you've managed to mess up your motorcycle in a simple install process. Um, I did make myself feel better. And I went on the internet after and looked up how many folks have done the exact same thing as me, not pulling off one little piece and not following one little step and managing to break and crack the same exact throttle induction manifold. So, did I cry about it? You'll have to see in next week's video. I, 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 I may have cried over it. I'm a little upset, just a little, and I'm allowed to be <sighs> fucked up my motorcycle. Am I a big baby? Yes. Yes, I will admit I'm a big baby, and when it comes to my sporty, if I mess her up and break her, I get real sad. I've been moping around, really hoping I could finish installing this filter, this new air filter for you guys, but you know what? An update video. This sporty will hopefully be looking different soon. 
Another goal of mine, and if SNS will still work with me after this debauchery, after this debacle, I swear it was user error. SNS had nothing to do with this. Their instructions were perfectly clear. I'm just an idiot. So fear not. This was totally user error, nothing to do with SNS, totally my fault. So, I'll show you guys the crack. It's pretty solid, pretty solid crack all the way through. I'm proud, I'm proud. Yep. No, I'm not, I'm actually extremely disappointed and very sad, but that's how you deal with your fuck ups. You admit them publicly to all your viewers and you say, hey, don't mess up like me and follow, follow step-by-step -step instructions. Don't be a dummy. But please, please make me feel better in the comments down below. Tell me how you've messed up your motorcycle in simple ways <sighs> that make it, you know, so it can't run. Cause I would have, if I installed this air filter now, I would have an air leak. <sighs> so uh, yeah, air would definitely come out of that. That crack right there, baby, she's open. And I don't want some airflow in there, so. Yes, please like this video. <laughs> Subscribe if you wanna see me actually put an air filter on this poor Harley. Please, please comment down below how you've messed up your motorcycle when you're trying to be an at-home mechanic. Shade tree mechanic, as they're called. A hey, shout out to my buddy Shade Tree, but this is what happens when I do things in the garage unsupervised. I kind of wing the instructions and break my motorcycle. But not all is lost. Lessons will be learned from this and parts will be bought, expensive parts. Like, you know, you'll remember not to mess this up again parts. So let me know if you guys have had to buy parts that you didn't need because you broke them in the process of installing another part. <laughs> I know you have. Don't pretend you haven't. Don't pretend in the comments like you've never broke a part on your motorcycle like this girl. This girl is the only person to ever do this. No, I know I'm not alone. Make me feel better. I have a little bit of a broken heart. I've never messed up anything on this Harley. I mean, like I've replaced parts and fixed things. You can go look at videos, I, I promise I have. Do I do it often? No. Um, and that's why my mechanical skills ain't so good, Pa. <laughs> I am so disappointed in myself for messing up this beautiful Harley. But like I said, Lessons have been learnt. Money has been spent. Parts will be hopefully sent soon. <sighs> all right guys, I can't wait to keep you updated on all the upgrades that are coming to the Sportster. Like I said, I'm ready to upgrade her. I'm ready for some new paint. I'm ready for, you know, some new pipes. I really wanna upgrade and do a crate engine kit, but we'll see. Like I said, hopefully SNS doesn't like totally blacklist me for messing up something so simple. Like I said, it's not their fault. It's totally user error. But yeah, I would love to crate engine this out and SNS has some great 1200 kits. So we'll see what happens kids. But if you know a great painter in your area, especially if you're local to the Northeast, Midwest area of the United States, I would love to get a amazing local painter to get their hands on my sporty and give me something special to me. I don't know, maybe make this a uh, competition bike. Maybe make this a bike that I put in some, put in some bike shows. I don't know. Odessa really, uh, she deserves it. So let's see what happens with the motorcycle. I don't know guys, but I appreciate you sticking around with this Sportster update and um, not roasting me too much in the comments for totally breaking. Not totally breaking, she's not broken. Just for now. She's still beautiful. She just needs some time to rest. A little bit of beauty, a little bit of upgrades. She just needs some love. <sighs> yeah, I can't believe that this is the video I'm bringing you guys instead of an SNS filter install video, but sometimes life just don't go your way. All right guys, well I'm gonna get back inside, drink the rest of my coffee, <sighs> not stress about how Odace is in pieces, and um, just wish you guys a happy holidays with your family. Thanks so much for watching, and I will catch all of you guys on the next one. <laughs>